<laughs> Our picnic blanket is turning out great, Mo! I agree! This will be perfect for me and Natsu's upcoming date! Yeah! Thanks, friend, for helping out! I don't know how much you were into romantic things like picnics. It's a shame that it's only the three of us. Who else would we invite? Well, maybe if friend considers getting a girlfriend, then they could join us for a double date! We just don't want friend to be lonely! You don't have to worry about that, Natsu! I'm their partner! Hey there, Avery! Friend, I'm so glad I found you! Look at all these super pretty flowers I picked out for you! Take all these and these! But friend, what are you doing? I still have more flowers to give to you! Avery, I hope you know that you and friend aren't in a relationship! Of course friend and I are dating! Friend would accept all my love flowers if we weren't in a relationship! Wait, friend, wait for me! I'm coming! You can calm down, Avery. I think friend just wants to put away some materials. We were just finishing up a new build for Mo and I's date. What's that you have there, friend? A book in your chest? Oh, what is it, type friend? I was wondering, would you like to go on a date with me? I think you're kind of cute and it would be great to hang out more. Heart your future girlfriend? Girlfriend? What? This must be some stupid prank. Doesn't the person who wrote this clearly know that you and I are already dating? I mean, I think we've made it abundantly clear that you're taken. Avery, what you have with friend isn't a real relationship. You made it clear that your friend's creepy yandere, not their romantic partner. Huh? Do you agree with Natsu? What? what? Well, I'm just gonna leave you then. <laughs> Ah, Avery will get over it. Let's go upstairs and get you ready to hang out with your future girlfriend on a date. We need to pick out a new outfit for you so you'll impress your secret admirer. You must have tons of options to pick from in your wardrobe. All right, hop in there and try on some clothes. Hmm, is that the cat superhero from Miraculous Ladybug and Cat Noir? I don't think that outfit suits you. Natsu, it's very cute that friend got a love note, but I wonder who it's from. It definitely wasn't Avery because they were confused too. Friend, that's boyfriend from Friday Night Funkin'. You can't wear that on your date. I think this will be a great chance for friend to explore their romantic options. It will give them an opportunity to get away from Avery for once. Hmm, that's better, but it seems like an evil version of you. I don't think that gives off the right impression. Let's see one more outfit, friend. There's there's people on the server who might be interested in friend that way, but I don't know who. <gasps> friend! That's perfect! It's just your style! Also, let's bring friend to their date with their future girlfriend! There was also writing on the back that said to meet at the cafe by the river, so we should go there! I got it! We'll get to the cafe really fast with my brand new car! The Natsu 5000 Speed Racer! Hop in, friend! I hope you're excited for your date! Here we are at the cafe. I'm really excited to help you on your date, friend. Natsu, there's so many people inside. How are we supposed to know which person is friend's future girlfriend? Hmm, what if you head inside first and take a look around? I'll take the car and find a parking spot. Let me know how the date goes, friend. Okay, Mo. Come on, friend. Time to go inside. Now, we need to figure out which one of these people sent you that note. Which one of these people wants to be your girlfriend? Do you think they'll come up to us or do we have to find them? I'm not really sure, friend. Either way, you'll have your best bud Natsu right by your side the whole time. We're gonna get through this together. Oh, hey friend, I'm surprised to see you here at this cafe. What about Natsu? No, I didn't see him here just now. You must have gotten my invitation to play my fun game. What game, you may ask? Well, there's someone who wants to be your girlfriend. So, I brought together some ladies to participate in a little challenge. It's up to you too, drum roll. Get the girlfriend! Some of our friends are in disguise, and you need to figure out which of them is pretending to be someone they're not. And who wants to be your future girlfriend? If you guess correctly and win, I'll give you all my diamonds and netherite. How's that sound? If you lose, then I get admin access on the server to ban you for a week. If you decide not to play at all, then I'll tell everyone you're a chicken. What do you think? Wanna play the game? Friend, Emmy's game is a horrible idea! How would you want to play a game to find a romantic partner you already have? You can't play! Friend can do whatever they want, Avery. They don't have to listen to your rules just because you're a crazy yandere stalker. What? No! Ugh, I'm gonna find some way to ruin your game! This won't be the last of me! <laughs> 
Don't even think about it, Avery. Let's go to the first challenge. The girlfriend introductions. We've made it to the village. The first spot of the girlfriend challenge. The competitors should be here any minute. Hi there! We're here! I'm here too! This is all so amazing! Uh, I'm here, but this boat is giving me some trouble. <laughs> Need some help? All right, since everyone's here, let's go into the village and begin the first round of our game. Friend, this is a starting challenge, so it will be really easy. All you need to do is spend some time with each of these girls. From these interactions, you'll be able to see their different personalities and decide which one is the perfect girlfriend for you. You'll also need to pick which of your friends in these disguises. Ooh, this is such a great opportunity! Yeah, I got something super fun planned. But why do I have to be second? <clears throat> okay, friend, I'll start off with my introduction. How about we take a little stroll through the village as a couple? We'll stop at these lovely gardens and harvest some crops together. And how about picking up some potatoes? Do you like eating potatoes, friend? They're very healthy for you. Oh, I also have some emeralds to give you as a gift so you can use them to trade with villagers to get some nice stuff. Oh, that's so lame, girlfriend number one. Come on, friend. I got an even better date introduction. I'm the cool girlfriend. So all my ideas are awesome. Who needs a garden when you've got pranks? Take this TNT and we can blow up this whole place together. Don't you like explosions? They're super neat, right? This is a great bonding experience for our first date. Place the TNT inside the blacksmith and light it up. Okay, friend, pack up. Yeah! How could you do that, girlfriend number two? You killed an innocent villager. Obviously, friend didn't like that. Nah, friend loved that prank. That is not true. Friend prefers my date. Let's not fight on the first round. You'll get to do that later. No, just get out of my face, girlfriend number two. You stop. This. I won't let you ruin my chances to win this game! Actually, you both suck as girlfriends. Friend deserves someone so much better than you. Psst. Hey, friend! I'm girlfriend number three. I think I saw Avery over there. I've got a great idea for my introduction that takes care of both of our problems. Follow me. I found these potions that can help you get away from Avery and have fun at the same time. They'll make us invisible for a short time. You're really gonna like this, friend. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and splash this potion. We're invisible now. This is perfect. Let's go fool the others since they can't see us. Uh, I told you I would ruin your game, Emmy. I'm gonna kill all of these girlfriends. Let's take care of Avery first. Grab them and toss them aside so they can't hurt the other girlfriends. You got this. Whoa, what's going on? Why am I flying around? Whoever picked me up, put me out now! Stop chasing me, you girlfriends! Uh, don't throw me in the water! I'm supposed to be the one chasing everyone else! This is ridiculous! I don't even see Fred anymore! You know what? I'm out of here! Don't bother following me! Great job, friend! <laughs> you did it! Hmm. I didn't think Avery would try to show up and mess with the challenge, but you were able to chase them away, friend. I hope you've gotten the chance to figure out who these girls are, because if you don't know, you're out of luck. Let's go to the boats and head back to the cafe. It's time for friend to make their choice. With the first challenge out of the way, it's time to pick which of your friends is in disguise as one of these girls. As you can see on this board, you have a list of names of your close friends. Whichever name you choose first will be the girlfriend who you eliminate. So select one wisely, friend. This will be a super easy choice for friend. They'll have to eliminate girlfriend number one. She did nothing. Which girl would you like to eliminate first, friend? Ooh, you pick girlfriend number two? Nice choice. Who is disguised as girlfriend number two? Friend will be able to figure that out. You think it's Tyser? Is that your final guess? No! No, I'm not Tysa! Look at that! You're right, friend! Arr, you guessed right! Didn't you like my TNT introduction, friend? I thought it was great! It's too bad you got eliminated, Tyser. Now you're a big loser! I'm not a loser! I just didn't win! Were you the person who wants to date, friend? Ew, no! I don't want to go on a date with friend! I'm only part of your game because you promised to pay me for my time! Pay up! You didn't spend that much time pretending to be a girl. And since you didn't win, you don't get any gold at all. Just for that, I'm going to explode this calf. You can't just blow up a building whenever you want to, Tyser. I can do whatever I want to. Friend, take care of Tyser. Ah! 
Ugh, Tyser is such a sore loser. He didn't play the game well now, so he doesn't get the gold I promised. But at least you made your first guess of the day correct, friend. <sighs> I need to figure out a new plan. Time for your second challenge. You have two more girlfriends to choose from. Let's go to the battle arena for the next round. Follow me right this way. Here's the battle arena. The next challenge for our game is a showdown of PvP. I hope you're ready to fight, girls. <sighs> I'm great at PvP. This will be easy. Uh, I'm not so good at PvP, but I'll still try my best. The girlfriends must now choose their weapons for the fight. Friend, keep a close eye to see which weapons each person picks. It might tell you who's under that disguise. Hmm, so what are our options here? Let's see… Nothing very interesting yet. I'm not very good with a sword. Oh, this is the perfect choice! A baseball bat! Oh, yeah! I could definitely get some good hits on girlfriend number three with this! A baseball bat won't be able to hit me. I'm gonna take this magic wand from my weapon. It's perfect! Have you made your final choices, girls? Okay, armor up so you can protect yourself from these weapons. Friend, do you recognize the colors of their armor? They just gave you a huge hint. I thought we'd give friend a chance to figure out who we are. If you're both ready to fight, it's time to start our PvP combat challenge. Friend, you can sit on the bleachers and I'll be over here judging the contest. You're going down, girlfriend one! <laughs> Not if I defeat you first, girlfriend three! I highly doubt that. You already said you suck at PvP. I got this! On your marks, get set, fight! You don't stand a chance! Hiya! Hey! That's cheating! You're using fire magic! I choose the magic wand! You should have picked a better weapon! <gasps> My baseball bat is a perfectly fine weapon! This fight is crazy! Friend, can you guess who girlfriend one and three are based on how they fight each other? Hmm, I think we should bring a bit of excitement to the battlefield! I summon some zombies to fight for me! Zombies? You know, if you weren't cheating before, this is definitely cheating! I fight all these zombies by myself? Ah! Friend, you're here to save me from the zombies? Oh, you've got this! No, I've got this. I'll help destroy these zombies before they hurt anyone. <laughs> That's all the dumb zombies. Who are you? Why, you don't look familiar. I don't think you're a part of the competition. I'm a last minute addition and a bit late, but I'm here now. Emmy definitely knows about me. If you say so. Welcome to the game, girlfriend number four. Huh, what if there's a winner for this battle? Hey, Emmy, what do you think? Emmy? Emmy? Hey, where'd she go? She probably had better things to do than sit around and watch a fight. What if she's in trouble? We know Emmy likes to get herself in danger. Guys, it's fine. I'm sure Emmy is totally okay and at her house or something. We can just continue the game ourselves. I don't have a great feeling about this. Friend, are those Emmys clothes in that chest? Oh, no, I'm getting really worried. I think girlfriend number four is right. Emmy will be perfectly okay on her own. You also really don't need her to be with us. Friend's choice is the only one that matters. I suppose so. Just watch out for Emmy, friend. You can lead the way. I don't know where we're supposed to go. I'll guide us straight back to the cafe. Now, I know you want to spend as much time with us as possible to get to know us, but you need to make a choice, friend. I know you can do it. We've been waiting around for so long for friend to pick one of us to eliminate. Don't you wish Emmy were here to keep things on track? She would do a better job than you. Well, Emmy's not here, so your comments aren't helping. Sorry, I'm just stressed about the chance of being eliminated. Who are you going to choose? Friends made their choice. It looks like they're going to pick. Girlfriend number three? Uh, wait, that's me! Okay, who do you think I am? You think that girlfriend three is Amber? Oh, let's find out. Yeah, it's me. The magic wand and potions gave it away, didn't it? You were right, friend. Girlfriend three was Amber. Did you send friend the note about being their future girlfriend? No, I didn't. Emmy promised that she'd give me unlimited potion ingredients, but since she isn't here and I didn't win, I'm guessing that I won't be getting anything! I hope you find who you're looking for, friend! Good luck! I'm gonna head back home! Bye, Amber! What a great guess, friend! You got Amber right! Now you only have two more girlfriends to choose from! Number one and number four! Me! I hope you make the right decision by picking me to be your girlfriend. I'm totally not here because Emmy asked me to. Hey! Friend! I wanted to see how things are going with finding your future girlfriend! Oh, you'd have to be a fool to think Lava would keep me down. Friend still has two more girls to choose from. Choose? Ooh, is this some kind of game you've gotten into? Hmm. Hey, friend? I have a theory about who these girls are. Uh, come with me real quick. Uh, ladies, it won't take long. I'll know if it does. 
Friend, I have a suspicion that one of your potential girlfriends might be Avery in disguise. I know they were upset after being rejected by you, and I haven't seen them all day. Don't you find that weird? It's possible that Avery might have entered the game as a late addition. They probably would have appeared if you were in trouble. Think about it. Ladies, I, the handsome Natsu, will come up with the final challenge. Well, hi, Natsu. And yeah, we'll take your lead since, you know, we just kind of disappeared. All right, climb into my car. I'll drive us to our destination. We're almost there. Ugh, I don't feel so well. How did everyone like the car ride? I try to go as fast as possible up the mountain. That was a horrible idea, Natsu. Oh, girlfriend number four is car sick. You can probably tell what I have planned for your final challenge by how the blocks are set up. So the potential girlfriends are going to have to quickly complete the parkour. You love doing parkour, so your girlfriend needs to love it too. Whoever gets to the finish line first will reveal who has the most in common with friend. Use this as a test to prove that you love friend. I'm going to sit up on this platform and do some commentary. It shouldn't matter who finishes the parkour first. It should be who puts in the effort. That's what a loser would say. I'm gonna start the parkour now. I'm definitely gonna win. I didn't count down. No, it's okay, Natsu. Girlfriend 4 just wanted a head start. Girlfriend number 4 is currently in the lead, and friend is on the way up. Girlfriend number 1 seems to be struggling, but they might be able to pull it around if they keep trying. Girlfriend number 4 has stopped, which is letting friend catch up. That was intentional, friend. I'm still gonna win. Friend and girlfriend number four are neck and neck at the front of the parkour. It seems friend may have found a shortcut. You can't get ahead of me. Ugh. Friend. Friend is now in the lead. They're almost at the finish line. Girlfriend number one is still working on those jumps. Try my best not to. Oh, I'm just I'm not very good at parkour. <gasps> friend wins. <laughs> I'm still going. Friend, you did it. You finished parkour first. Girlfriend number four is right behind you. Girlfriend number one, you should just give up. You suck at this. I'm almost there. I can do this. We're just waiting on you, girlfriend number one. Oh, I'm just going to meet up with you over there. <laughs> girlfriend one, come back here. Look out. Avery is here. You're still playing this stupid game to try and date, friend. Well, no one is going to win but me. No, 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 no. Avery, wait. I'm not in love with friend. <gasps> Girlfriend number one was Luna. You should be thanking me, friend. I saved you from someone who wanted to take you away from me. We don't want you here, Avery. Go away. Who are you? You're being really rude, random girl. Avery, you won't ruin this for me. Get out of here. Ah! It won't be long until Avery finds us again. Natsu, we need to leave this place right now. Where should we go? Let's go back to spawn. It'll be safe there. We need to find somewhere safe nearby. Come on. Let's head to my house. I doubt Avery will look there. <laughs> I found you. Run away! Well, your house isn't an option anymore. Go to Moe's. Hopefully she's not there. I don't want her to get hurt. I'm going to get you. <laughs> Where'd you go? Avery is so weird. Come on, get inside Moe's house before they find us. We need a new plan. How do we get rid of Avery? Avery's gone full yandere mode. Okay, I think I have a plan that we can use to distract Avery while we finish the challenge. You just need to trust me. Sure, girlfriend number four. We don't have many options. You two need to switch clothes. Avery will track friends sent on you, Natsu. I guess that could work. Remember, we can switch our clothes the easy way. Nice! There we go! Now I'm just like you! All right, Natsu. Go out there and distract Avery by pretending to be a friend. Here I go! Oh, you think you're smart by pretending to be a friend, Natsu? You're dead! This went badly! I've gotta go! Well, that still counts as a distraction. Come on, friend. I think there might be something that we can use to defeat Avery at my... I mean, Emmy's house. We just need to make our way over there without Avery seeing us walk past them. Natsu! You can't hide in your house forever! I'm gonna get you! Keep searching for something useful, friend. You found an elytra, fireworks, and a sword? That's perfect! Stay away! <laughs> your girlfriend's house is going up in smoke! No, not Mo's house! You won't get away from me, Natsu! I don't wanna die again! No! There you are! I see you in that window! I'm coming for you, friend! Oh, this is really bad, friend! We need to get out of here as soon as possible! Let's go to Emmy's roof! Avery won't be able to catch us up there! I know you're good at parkour, so you can definitely jump faster than that! Oh, Avery is blowing up the whole house! All right, friend! Use your Electra to fly down to the cafe! Go, 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 go! Where are you two going? Ah, the cafe by the river! I'm on my way, friend! You have an idea, friend? We just need to get Avery to the trapdoor in the ground? You saw the trapdoor- 
I mean, oh my goodness, there's this trap door? Well, friend, I love you for being so smart, but you can't trick me by having not to dress up in your clothes. Now, we don't need to worry about any of this. Is huh? What? No, don't do this, friend! You killed Avery in the lava! That was a great idea, friend! Don't you think we make a good team? Hey, friend! I'm here! I heard some explosions over at spawn! Are you okay? Friend is totally fine! Did you ever figure out which person wrote you that note about being your future girlfriend? You found another book? I wonder if friend would ever consider me as their girlfriend, Emmy. Oh! She must have written you the note from earlier! No, she didn't! Emmy didn't write that. They also know that you're Emmy, girlfriend number four. Whatever, fine. You've guessed the correct girlfriend, friend. I wrote that note. Why didn't you just tell friend how you feel, Emmy? You could have avoided playing this silly game with them. That note was wrong. I didn't actually want to be their girlfriend. But you just said you do. I wrote the letter to bring friend to the cafe so we could play the game. I thought friend was going to lose so I could ban them from the server. I definitely don't like like friend. Uh. Uh-huh. Just admit you like friend. Don't bother me about it again. I'm out of here, losers. Oh, well, we tried, friend. 